Hello everybody, it's IP Games back here again, and this time it is episode 2, thank you for watching episode 1, and today I am with Ionic. Aloha! And as you can see from my screen right now, we have had a lot of changes. So we've done a lot of off-camera cam work, and so I'm just going to show you this up top place uh, a little here first. So we've hollowed out one tree, and that just gave us, I'll show you how much wood that gave us. It's a bit ridiculous. Um, so there's not re really much going on up here yet. So if we, we can go down these stairs. We go to up and down forever. And we are down here. So this is where our beds are. And I did sleep in a bed, FYI. Okay. And then we have uh, just like a little area down here just to chill. Um, I'll show you the monster. I'll have Ionic show us the monster spawner in a second. But um, basically, this is our little chest area. We have a smeltery going. We have a rudimentary farm. And we got some trees. Is this a silverwood tree? It is a silverwood tree. Yes. So, yeah. Um, I did make you some iron armor. Oh, thank you. It's in the ender chest. Fresh armor. Yes. Alright, so do you want us to show us the monster spawner? Yeah, sure. So let me get equipped here. All right. And I'm not naked anymore, yay. Yay. Okay, so come on down this way. Now the other the first episode we were kind of under siege by zombies. And we were. it took me a little doing, and I figured out why, because right here, and I've done a little modification, there's a zombie spawner. So I figured, why not build ourselves a little grinder? Free XP, free uh, rotten meat that we can hang up on the drying rack and get some nice jerky for, and make it useful. How do we get a mighty smelting book? That automatically appears as soon as you uh, create a smelting block. Gotcha. Well, cool. Yeah, so we got a little sponsor spawner if we never need any money, any uh, mod drops, which is nice. And then we have the morph mod guys. So if you look at my screen, we I have all of these different morphs, and they all have different abilities. So I was flying it because I had I had a bat, and I'm actually I'm going to become a creeper. A creeper kid. Isn't that cute? <laughs> ah, no, 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 no! Oh, don't kill me. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, now look up. Yeah, I showed him that. That's where I started off. That took some time. <laughs> and that was I... before I fixed flight, so that was all shift. Hmm. I only fell three Ugh. times. <laughs> yeah, so we did have a chicken, um, like, kind of farm here. We had a bunch of eggs, but it just created so much lag. Um, we're at 19. It was at 5. It was the lowest we got was 3 ticks per second. So we kind of we shut it off. Yeah, it was we've causing got the, way too much lag. We've got the eggs. We can spawn some chickens if we need more food, but we've got the farm running, and... We did a lot of mining. And we did done do a lot of other work. We did a lot of mining. We did. So this is kind of our ore's chest. Um, I, I just smelted up a bunch of the iron. Um, we got our dust. And then this is just from one tree. The, the, That's all not even stuff. the whole tree. Exactly. So this is a great place to to start out. Um, actually, I'm gonna pop this stuff, the sand in the furnace. Oh, creeper, creeper, creeper. Oh, oh dear. Ooh, they light up. Well, at least it was away from the chest. Yeah, that's. I was just trying to kite them away. That's all I cared. Yeah. All right, let's rebuild that. All right, um, I don't have any grass. Did you grab some? From the... Um, there should be dirt in one of the chests here. Alright. I'll grab some wood. 
Ooh, that's not the right wood. That's yeah, root. Yeah, close enough. Yeah, whatever. I'll go grab the right root, or the right wood. There we go, bark. Sorry, we had a mini creeper attack. Alright, good enough. Um, oh yeah, there's the dirt. Alright, so... May I ask what this hole is for? That's gonna be a well for the uh, accumulator. Oh, cool. The Aquas Accumulator, I think? Okay, I think it's called. Cool. Uh, so, what we want to do today is we want to make a quarry. And I think we want to do some ender stuff too, right? Yeah, we need to find a desert to find some, uh, I think they're blaze blooms or fire blooms or something like that, but you can get uh, blaze powder from them. Okay, cool. Alright, so we got a couple chests just for what we want. So we got all the stuff we need for our quarry. Um, and then we got some piping for it. We found a... You might want to... How about you enlighten us on, uh, all the things you found in our, uh, in your little dungeon hunt. Oh, I, um... Okay, so if, if you've played the, uh, the Yogg's Quest Complete Pack before, you know we've got the, um, Better Dungeons mod installed. Let me just flip over to a bat form here so I can fly over. Alright, I'll follow you. That cracking sound. Right. It's just creepy. I'll so have to, you, so you raided this dungeon soon, but... over here? Yeah, but I, I did it kind of cheaty. Okay, so... What I did is, apparently when glass plane panes are next to water, they create an airspace, so you don't have to worry too much about drowning. So what I did is I would went around to each room and grabbed what chests I could reach, just by breaking the glass and reaching through. <laughs> I know thing. it's a little cheaty, oh, but geez. you know what? I don't, yeah, they can shoot you. Yeah, yeah so you we're going to... I think what I want to do at some point, maybe once we get this core going, is I want to make power armor and then just destroy these people. Oh, yeah, because these tridents are, are wicked hard. Really, yeah, I mean, really hard. I mean, 25 health on average, and every single one of them will heal themselves. Exactly. So I want to get some power on me before we do that, and hopefully that can be sometime soon, because we're pretty well off. Yeah, yeah, it's not a problem. What I was thinking is once we kill everything, is um, and once the quarry is finished, we just bring it over, set it up, and quarry out the middle of this building. Okay. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's, that would not be a bad idea. And there's one under us, too. Yeah, I saw that. So we got two really good dungeons. I can see a chest over there. Um, so we're going to do that at some point. Actually, four. Because there's one over here, too, that I just noticed. Oh, huh. really? Yeah. Wow. There's two of the glass buildings, and then there's the two lower stone ones. So Sweet. it'll be really fun to, to raid the heck out of this. Yeah, that's going to be something I want to do. So... All right, so I want to let's get started on that quarry, and then if you want to, do you want to build the pump? I got a bunch of glass. Actually, we can yeah. both work on the pump because we have all the stuff for the quarry already. Yeah, which pump were you thinking of? Um, you said you didn't like the quarry plus pumps. No, nah, kind of every time I've tried them within just a few minutes, the game just locks up. Yeah, so we're just going to do the regular quarry and the regular pump, because, I mean, those are fine. Maybe at some point we can do maybe the ender pump? That would work. Then we wouldn't, all we would have to have is power. We wouldn't have to tank it all that um, much. What is it called again? Endothermic pump. Endo. Endothermic. Yeah, it's kind of a weird name. just have to um let's see there endothermic pump okay okay so that's actually we could probably just make that we actually might need a couple more ender pearls so one thing that i do want to do is i want to 
make a safari net. Can we can we do those? Yes, okay, we can. So I want to do that and I want to uh capture an Enderman so we can create an Enderman farm. Uh we can use MFR to uh automate that. So that's one of the things that I want to get started on. Does that sound like a good idea? Yeah, we can work on that. Okay, cool. Alright, so I might just put this quarry together first, and then we're probably going to have to put the pump together for and then... Because what are we going to do for power for right now? You, you got a wind turbine, didn't you? Yeah. And that's another thing about the um, Better Dungeons mod, is you find good stuff, not crap, like you do in a lot of the other, other but, like, vanilla dungeons. Yeah. I mean, I think like, the best you can find is a saddle at times. Yeah. I mean, I found a harvester, and just the first couple upper levels, I found a harvester and a wind turbine. Yeah, I mean, that's just a bit ridiculous. That wind turbine is going to come in handy, though. Yeah, it is, as soon as we set up that quarry. <laughs> yeah. All right, so, actually, do you want to grab the stuff out of the piping and for the yeah, ender sure. quarry? And I did, I did make a trash can. I've got some diamond pipes that were not inundated by cobble, dirt, sand, and gravel. So. Okay. So let me turn into a bat, and we can figure out where we want to set this up at. So where exactly did you go? Actually, do you did you make landmarks? I did. How many do you have? Four or five? I have six. You have six. Okay. So I'm gonna. Did you make levers at all? No, I didn't. I forgot about that. I will make a couple real quick. I got some sticks on me and some cobble. Here, I've got some stone. Was it cobble or stone? It's cobble. There okay. you go. I just made eight. I always forget about that. <laughs> all right. So, all right. Um, so let's go figure out where we want to put this. Now, I do believe the quarry has um, a chunk loader. Yeah, it does. It will load the chunks for us. So, I don't know. What are you thinking about where you want to put this? I want to impact as little water as we can, maybe in this square right here. Hey, you know what we can do is we can put it up on top of this mountain here. That we could do. Well, it's not really a mountain, but Molehill. we could. <laughs> because I want to make the I want to make this huge. I want to make it sixty-four by sixty-four. Is basically what I want to do. How about right here? Because keep in mind, the more flowing water we have, the more right it's going to lag. So if we put it. Right, we can put it right. I see water, so let's put. We can put it like right here. Does that sound like a good place? And then it will go. It will go that way and that way, and it looks like we should be good with the water. Okay, let me uh, let me give you some landmarks here. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go grab some cobblestone because the higher, I think, I think. The higher the uh, the wind turbine is, the more power it produces. Is that right? Yes. Yeah. So I'm going to go grab some more cobblestone, maybe. Oh, and you also found a division sigil, didn't you? Yes. So what we can do with that is we can make builder's wands at some point. When we, we have one. To. We have a builder's wand? I actually wand? found one, yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, that just makes my life a lot easier, because we can build a platform pretty quick with that. Alright, so I need to find the cobblestone chest. Actually, there's dirt. That's even better. Okay. Okay. Alright, sweet. Here, do you want some dirt? I've got some. Okay. Got quite a bit, actually. 
Let's see, you need room for 10 chests. Oh yeah, you brought chests, didn't you? Did we yeah. make enough? Okay, good. Yeah, I only made 10 because I figured we could filter. Does the I did trash... Make... I, mean, I have a quick question for you. Does the trash can delete instantaneously? Yes. Okay, good. Because I don't, if it didn't, because I know some mods don't. Um, like some mods, trash cans don't do that. I was gonna say I don't know if we're gonna be able to keep up with the just huge amount of intake that it's gonna it's gonna cause. So how high do you want to set this up? So let's put it right here, next to this golden pipe. The wind turbine. Yeah, the wind turbine's going to have to go. We'll put the quarry right here in the corner, and the wind turbine will have to go right next to it. Okay. So actually, we got to place the landmarks down first, is what we have to do. So could you it, toss me those landmarks real quick? Yeah, sure. Or at least one, one or two of them? There you are. Okay. Have you got enough cobble to pillar up? Uh, I think so. Yeah. Okay. Let me. I'm just gonna smack some torches down real quick. Okay. So. Wait. So what is this exactly for? Is this for the just the chests or? Yeah. Just transport pipe. Okay. So how high do you want the quarry to be up? About the same level as this platform that we're on. Okay. So I'll put that down there. I did not know you could do that. Yeah. Uh, huh. You just put a lever down, lever down next to it, and it will make it will default uh, 64 blocks in either in every single direction, and that's how big the quarry maxes out at. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's one of the features about the quarry plus is that it can go. I think it can go two chunks, so 28 by 28, 128. Sorry. All right, so there is another one, and so, oops, we just need to go 32 more blocks, or actually, is it going to be 64? Yeah, I think so. And I ran out of blocks. Do you have a bunch more dirt? I have 13 more. Okay, I'm going to have to mine this up. If you can toss me that real quick. I need my iron shovel. Thank you. And I'll mine this up. And what is nice is we'll get these landmarks back too. Yeah. They're not horribly expensive, but lapis isn't that easy to find. Yeah, definitely. Especially and we're gonna be using more packs. quarries at the in the end. So, what is the benefit of a uh, ender quarry versus a regular oh, one? An ender quarry only loads one chunk at a time, and it replaces everything that you mine. It mines with a block of dirt, so, so you're it's not left server with big, friendly. Yeah, you're not left with big gaping world holes. Gotcha. I okay. may add ICBM into this mod pack just so I can use the rejuvenation missile. <laughs> yeah, that my that, I love ICBM. That's one of the that's actually that's the first mod that's the first mod that ever got me interested in playing with mods. That was the first thing. I mean, I saw it on a. Uh, I saw it actually on a YouTube video. Uh, it was one of the YouTubers I still watch now. And, uh... You just, um, selected the entire platform. Ooh. Crap. I'd say, uh, just switch that side. I'll just break these, so... I'll have to put it right there, then. So how many blocks is that? One, two, three... Four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, 
so I had to move eight more blocks. That's not too bad. Sorry, I didn't I didn't notice. That's fine. It shit happens. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, cool. So this should all connect now. Yep, sweet. Is that intersecting at all? Uh yeah, that looks that looks good actually. Alright, good. And then so we can just delete this. And bam. There is our 64 by 64 quarry. Uh, no. It uh, didn't place properly. I can oh, see the tagline. It might be your... That actually happens. That's a bug, known bug. It actually, for me, it looks like it's 64 by 64. I think it's actually okay. kind of a bug. It's a visual bug, so... Are we just gonna how so how do you plan on uh powering it? Do you have power do we have uh, like conduit or are you just gonna smack it on top? I'll have to turn it around, hold on. There she goes. I gotta get the pipes in fast. <laughs> oh wow, that's actually going that's moving pretty quick. Dang. These 37 RF would take a lot. It's going down now. Ooh. We're going to have to add power to it, but it'll be alright for now. Alright. It's at 33 RF would take now. It'll settle out in a minute. Actually, you know what I might do is I might go make some more conduit, and I just want to maybe just, like, put this all the way up, like, super tall. Okay. Yeah, that'd be fine. You get the higher you are, the better it is. Right. So I'm going to go home real quick, because I just want to get the most efficiency as I can out of it. Yeah. All right, what kind of pipes do you think I should make? Should I make gold or um for power transfer? Yeah. Um, you know what? It, I've I've played with this pack before, and I've always had a little bit of trouble finding which particular one powers properly. Okay. So I think. Oh, the one I know works is Redstone Energy Conduit. That stuff's expensive. Yeah, that stuff is expensive. But there's Leadstone Energy Conduit, which is easier, I guess, a little bit. Um, so they added a bunch of new pipes that I don't know what actually they do. Weird. Um, let's look for... What is this? Armor mo armor module? Potato gun? I've never even seen this before. The potato gun will shoot potatoes at mobs for you. It's not really effective, but it's a whole lot of fun. Huh. That's actually kind of funny. Ender nail? Huh. The Weird. nail the pneumatic nail gun is fun. Hmm. I've never i I've never seen that before. It, you have to make a lot of nails, and it's ungodly expensive to get started, but it is a real blast once you get going. That's awesome. Hey, there is a kinetic engine that we could use also for power. But, um... So there's a kinesis switch pipe. Uh, I'm not sure... 
I know the wires don't work well at all. Yeah. Let me look up leadstone. Conduit. Let's see. Yeah, so it's two pieces of lead, a piece of glass, and redstone. That gives you six. So I might just make that. Do we have any lead cooked up? We don't. Well, actually, no, we do. We have a couple of blocks. Okay. So, four... Okay, I'll make th that much. Actually, I'm going to need some redstone. Split that. Alright. So I have 24. Alright, I will break this uh, windmill. Alright, so I'm heading over there. Ow. I need to waypoint this as soon as I get over there. Oh, good reminder. Thank you. I mean, it's not too far away, but why better to do it and not forget? Yeah. All right, cool. So, Go to gravel, sand, and, and dirt. Cool. Yep. So dump it on the front there, and you can actually just lay the pipe. Ooh. This might be a problem here. Uh, oh, the connector? Yeah, it's connecting yeah, to the other quarry, too. Alright, so I'm just going to pretty much nerd pull all the way up as high as I can get with these 20 pipes. Or conduits. Alright. Hmm. You might just want to put the trash can maybe on top. Yeah, it's directly connected. Here, I'll break it for you. Yeah, perfect. Alright, hey, and I found a trick out. Um, Actually, it's kind of self-explanatory, but no one actually, I mean, I didn't know it. So if you hold, if you're flying and you hold space and shift at the same time, you don't move. Really? Yeah. I'd like to have known that like six months ago. Can you um <laughs> Never throw, pass throw some dirt and some cobble there? Yep. Into that filter? Dirt. Ooh, I do not have any cobble, but I shall get some. Okay. Sweet. All right. So that should be working. So all you need to, and all is left to do is put that windmill up on there. Oh yeah. And, okay. Why does it start so high? Is my question. I don't know. It, yeah, I really don't know. There we go. It's doing a heck of a lot better, though. That's true. Oh, now it's normal. <laughs> I, oh, I think that... I think that it... Because look, if I wrench it the, the wrong way, it, I think that's its internal power buffer. So I think it's actually it's producing 103 RF at tick. Okay. Does that make... I don't know. Yeah, I don't know that, that, that actually sense. does make some more sense. And then it's only uh, 192 R for take out. Okay. 
we're getting good power, and it's continually going up, so I think we're, we're okay. I just found a huge blister on my foot. Alright, and there comes the dirt. It looks like it's all getting voided. Everything is working good. So I think we can just go and let this run. Yep, I um, will probably have to make a chunk loader, but that's okay. I don't know if we will, because it, it loads all the chunks. What is, I forgot, what is the key to show the chunks? Ooh. Well, that did something. I'm not exactly sure. Oh, I think that just shows the chunk I'm in. Um, oops, that's not what I want to do. I just got out of full screen. Okay, F8. Ah, uh, that sucks. Oh, okay, there we go. I got some chunk loading screen. Yeah, so it's going to load all of these chunks that are around it. Because there's a chunk boundary on this block right here. And the quarry is inside of this chunk. And, like, I'm running along the chunk, one of the chunk boundaries right now.